Hi guys, welcome back to Cards TV. This is Mary, and today we're going to make a graduation card for a cute little girl named Emily, and she's going to be graduating from pre-kindergarten at the end of this month, and her mom asked if anyone would like to send her some graduation cards. So several of us on Facebook said we would, so this card is for little Emily. I used the Everyday Pop-Up Cards cartridge, the Create a Friend, and this one is really, really cute. I got some paper from this Die Cuts with a View Fall and Halloween Basic Stack. And for my sentiments, I used two of my Cards TV stamp sets. I used Mixed Messages, and we're going to use Hats Off to You. And then for the inside... We'll use It's All About You, and we're going to use You Did It. So I'm going to get all of this moved out of the way, and we're going to get started on Emily's card. For the card base, I decided to use this card in Everyday Pop-Up Cards. It's this one right here, and I love that curve. And this one's on page 40, and I cut it at 5.5 inches, which gave me... A four and a quarter by five and a half inch card when folded. Now you can see in the book it's folded so that the narrow part of the curve is at the top. Well, I folded mine the opposite way because I wanted the narrow part at the bottom and I wanted this wider part up at the top. So that's what I did. I just folded it in the opposite direction. Now I've already done the inside. I've got a yellow background mat and then this cute paper from that die cuts with the view pack and it's got all these little tiny multicolored polka dots on it and then I've got a blue mat and then a white sentiment mat and this is where I use the stamp from the uh, cards tv set called it's all about you and I stamped you did it and of course I used memento tuxedo black ink and now we're going to do the front of the card See how that curve looks? I love that. I took some yellow paper and cut a border and then some more of the polka dot and cut another little border to fit on top of that. I'm going to adhere this together and put that right here on this side of the card. So I'll grab my ATG gun and get that adhered and on the front of the card. Okay. I'm loving these colors and patterns on here. Now, I've cut a banner, and this is about three quarters of an inch wide, and I'm going to put that right here and let it extend into that curve right there. So I'm going to add this with the ATG gun, and then I'll show you what's going on the front, and it's from the Create a Friend cartridge, and it is so cute. I think Emily's going to like it. Okay, I've got my banner on. Now from the Create a Friend cartridge on page 11 and 12, you'll find this cute little girl graduate. And she's got several layers to her. And I cut her out at four and a half inches. And here she is right here. Now I did not put her hat on her head. I don't have this little pink uh, flower necklace. I'm not sure what that is or why she'd be wearing it. <laughs> Maybe she graduated in Hawaii and it's a lay. I don't know. And I didn't cut out the diploma. And I'll show you why. Now, like I said, I cut her at four and a half inches. She's going to go right there. And I wanted to leave her hand empty instead of putting the diploma in. Because she is throwing her hat in the air. Her little mortar board. And I'm putting that right up there at an angle so it looks like she's thrown it. And I've got that on some foam tape as well. And then I took an inch and a half uh, punch and punched out a circle. And with that mixed message, messages, <laughs> that's hard to say, mixed messages stamp set, I stamped hats off to you and once again I use memento tuxedo black ink I'm going to add that right down here and then I took this little studio G heart punch 
and I punched out a little red heart and I'm going to put that right there just for a little pop of color. So I'm going to get all of this adhered down and we'll come back and take a final look at Emily's graduation card. I hope she likes it. I think it turned out really cute. Here's my finished card for little Emily. And on the front, we've got a little graduation girl, and she's tossing her hat in the air. And it says, hats off to you. And on the inside, you did it. And I've got plenty of room left to write a little message and sign my name. I think it turned out really cute. And I'll have all the list of supplies that I used, as well as all the cut sizes, and everything at the end of the video, guys. If you'd like to recreate this little card, for somebody special in your life that's graduating. may not be from pre-kindergarten, but I think this would be suitable for right on up through middle school. And there's a little boy in that Creative Friend cartridge, too. A little boy graduate. There he is right there. And he is also super cute. So thanks for coming by today, guys. I hope you had a good time and got inspired. And I will see you again soon with another card. Bye now.